Hello guys, in this video, let's delete an item or document in Cosmos DB from Visual Studio C Sharp. So we are in Azure portal and I open this database, test database. Under that, we have this container C users. And if I click on items, and if I check this third item, so you can see we have this item with this ID and the name is David Kent. And now let's try to delete this item. Now guys, we are in Visual Studio and this is the same code from our previous videos. So basically using this code, we created an item in Cosmos and we also updated an item. But still a quick recap. So this is the connection string to connect to our Cosmos DB. Then we created this Cosmos client. Then we created this Cosmos container using Cosmos client and using this Cosmos container, we can create item, we can update item, we can delete an item in Cosmos DB. And now let's update this code to delete an item. So again, uh, you can see this line number 22. That is, we'll say Cosmos container dot, we'll say delete item async. And to this, we need to provide the ID of that document, which we want to delete. And so again, let's go to the portal. So let's copy this document ID. And I'll paste it over here. And also we need to provide the partition key as well. And we know the partition key is city in our case. So again, let's go over here and let's copy the value of city that is Berlin. So I'll copy it and paste it over here. And finally, here in this console line, I will say record has been deleted. So let's add a debugger over here. And here also we'll say let's delete record. Let's save and let's run. And you can see our debugger has been hit. That means record must have been deleted from Cosmos DB. So let's check it in the portal. So here again, I'll click on this edit filter and apply filter. That means we are rerunning this select star query. And now you can see we have only two records. And if I check the last record, see the record of David Kane, that is city Berlin is missing. That's, that means it's been successfully deleted.